Innovative Missions in Mexico City, Music Missions Abroad, a production of Pan American Missions Incorporated. Since God's command is to proclaim His message of the gospel to all the ends of the earth, how can one fulfill or at least be a part of His plan with the gifts and abilities that He has placed in our trust? Literally, millions must hear the message proclaimed and turn to God through Jesus Christ as Savior. Innovative missions can and must be used to reach the multitudes with the message of the gospel. How can that be accomplished? First, join God where He is working. This was one of the most valuable lessons that Leslie and Claudia Gomez learned a few years back when faced with the decision of returning to Mexico after a sabbatical leave. Mexico, a country deeply rooted in Roman Catholicism, has been resistant to evangelical missionary work for decades. However, the large concrete jungles have created a vacuum, a need that people long to satisfy. The close-knit family unit is no longer giving this culture its coherence and unity. Values are going out of style in a society that has long been cemented and held together through moral values. The breakdown of the family in Mexican society is undermining what has been its special secret ingredient close family ties. And because family was created in God's heart, there are those in Mexico desperately looking for answers to hold a family together. That's it. People are turning to God and to Scripture for answers to what is currently threatening their most valuable ingredient in Mexican culture, loyalty to family. It is amazing to see those who are affluent in an emerging upper middle class in Mexico eager to hear a message of hope. And because Mexicans in general are sensitive to emotional and spiritual needs, they're more open than ever. Yes, God's Spirit is penetrating the very threads that hold together Mexican identity. This is nothing less than a ripe field. A ripe field must be harvested in the right season. Second, use innovative ideas. Methods that worked or those used in the past may no longer be the best strategy to reach the unchurched. Fire and brimstone preaching has given way to a message of hope in a chaotic world that we must face daily. Combine that with meaningful worship and you've got a plot of land that will yield 30 60 and a hundred fold. If you get a good communicator of the gospel and good quality praise music, the results are clearly visible. The church where the Gomez's have invested much of their lives for the last 15 years has grown by leaps and bounds. From two traditional worship services in 1990 with 300 attending, to a purpose-driven church holding six services on the weekends, and 2,300 attending. In music and worship ministry alone, there are close to 300 participating. Five praise teams. A vibrant projection ministry. Drama. Sound. A graded choir program. Events to reach the lost, a music school with close to 100 students, and more recently, a video production ministry just now taking off. Much of the music used has to be produced since it is not readily available. Thus, the use of the latest technology is what Leslie Gomez is turning to. Pro Tools, MIDI instruments, CD, and DVD production with the Final Cut software. Since distribution continues to be a costly and ineffective means to get the music and worship out, Leslie will turn to downloading and to digital formats to distribute musical products out to those looking for it. Proclaim the message. Get it done through music. Music gets to the heart of the people in stunning firewire speed these days. 
for those that shy away from traditional preaching, music will get their attention. So Leslie believes that his labor is not in vain. After seeing great results, 30-fold, 60-fold, and 100-fold in his own backyard, he makes some of these productions available for others to use in printed music and stereo CDs. It's like an investment. You have a capital fund, but you also reap an interest without doing it all on your own effort, getting others involved. Leslie has discovered that if a few around him catch on to the vision, his task is not only to make music work for his ministry, but to get others to join in and do the work. Leslie continues to do much of the work in direct contact with those around him, his leaders in the ministry, the two choirs that he currently leads, the church staff, his own staff. Now he looks ahead to perhaps 12 years of fruitful ministry before retirement. He has pondered on what ways or methods could possibly produce the most impact. Leslie has concluded that given a clear vision, it will take you where you need to go. For the last three years, he has considered a video production effort that will provide an outreach without borders. Considering that his music ministry has an impact in other Spanish-speaking countries, Leslie wants to convey the goals through video production, through television via satellite, through DVD productions and digital formats. This dream has recently been confirmed through a retired couple that have offered a substantial donation for the purpose of purchasing camera and video equipment as well as post-production hardware and software. The stage is set for a new phase of ministry in the years to come. Leslie will soon work in close contact with Continental Singers Ministry that has taken the gospel through music to continents in more than 80 countries around the globe. Cam Floria, founder of the Continental Singers, wants a permanent ministry in Spanish with a Continental group working out of Mexico. Music definitely breaks down barriers. Hearts are melted and softened, and thus many can receive Jesus Christ as Lord and Savior. Pan American Missions challenges you to be an active part of the ministry of Leslie and Claudia Gomez in Mexico. How? Through intercession and prayer and through your generous financial support. Your gifts through Pan American Missions are tax deductible and will give the Gomez family stationed in Mexico City an opportunity to carry on with their goals to reach many Spanish speakers through innovative missions.